in the modern era of golf instruction, much of what's being taught is about using the body. And that's great. It needs to be. What we have lost is the skill of using our hands to hit the golf ball. And so many golfers that come to GMS, and probably who don't, have become so involved with the turning of the shoulders, turning of the hips, the shifting the weight, etc. They have lost the use of their hands in the golf swing. And the golf swing, the hands are very important. They are the closest to the club face. So if this is the club face right here, if I just turn my hands a little, tiny bit, look, look at my thumb, my right thumb right here. It's hardly moving, but look how much the club face has moved. So as I'm hitting a golf ball and I'm swinging and I'm coming in, that ball's going right, that ball's going left, that's probably pretty straight. But watch this, if this thumb just is over here, just a tiny bit, that club face is pointing to the right and there's a slice there, that's hardly anything. And so what we have lost is this ability to swing and get the club to get back to here. The motor skill of getting using the hands. As you start swinging the golf club is when we find that most people stop using their hands. They get over the golf ball, and we, I say this because of all the golfers we see at GMS, and we ask a lot of questions, and they tell us, hey, what are you doing on your backswing? Oh, on my backswing, I'm trying, really trying to turn my shoulders, set my head so it doesn't move, uh, get this rotation right here, and I gotta get that club toe up. And everything they mention, well, they don't mention hands, because so many people have taught them, don't use your hands. Now, why is that? A lot of that is because you're getting lessons from the better players. The better players don't have the problem of slicing the ball. If they hit a bad shot, it's usually what? A hook. So the better players are often called handsy because as they're swinging, they are whipping the th club through like this and they're getting these big old hooks. So in their golf swing, they've taken their hands out of it. However, unfortunately, many people watching this don't have that problem. You hit it to the right, but you're getting lessons from somebody who is teaching you how to stop hitting it left. And now because of that, they're taking your hands out of it because that's what they do. And if you take your hands out of it, you're gonna get even less distance and you're gonna hit it more to the right. So keep watching our videos as we start talking about how to integrate your hands with the rest of your body so you have a complete golf swing that swings smooth, nothing just like where you're trying to hold your and go. We're gonna to learn to try to get everything moving together. This is Mark Solomon at Indian Wells Golf Club, a true managed facility saying thank you very much. I look forward to talking to you next week about improving your golf swing.